Hi, good morning. Today's topic of discussion is banking features in telecom. So these banking features facilitates the maintenance of records and processes that are fundamental to an effective recording of accounting transactions for timely payments in telecom. This feature enables business owners to perform a host of bank related activities including payment to parties, bank reconciliation and check management. Using this feature enhances and simplifies the banking experience significantly by saving time, reducing errors, improving productivity and scaling up traceability. The banking feature provides an end to end solution to the banking needs for running your company. The banking module has been enhanced in Teleprime to simplify the overall banking experience, recording transactions and generating various banking reports. The banking module focuses on managing and streamlining banking transactions and activities. Now they have shown me like what kind of activities I can perform under banking in Teleprime. So I can, uh, pro I can make check registers. I can uh, like uh, print out deposit slips like cash deposit slips and check deposit slips. I can uh, record payment advice and I can also print payment advice and I can do manual bank reconciliation under banking features in Teleprime. So first of all I will show you how I can generate deposit slips in Teleprime. So first of all you should know about the deposit slip. So the deposit slip option in banking enables you to generate deposit slips for cash or checks that are deposited to the bank for any date in Teleprime. So here first of all you should know about the deposit check deposit slip. The check deposit slip option in the banking menu allows you to generate deposit slips for payment received through check or demand draft which need to be deposited into the bank. You can access print and configure check deposit slips in Teleprime as required. So for this they have given me one practical question. I'll open my vouchers. Here they have uh, told me that my company is receiving the payment from Arihant Technologies white sale bill number 7 and 11 amounted to rupees 2 lakh 21,500 and 14,800 respectively. Both the payments have been received by a check 896110 of State Bank of India which is deposited later on to SBI current account. So I'll, what I'll do, I'll, open, I'll simply press Alt plus C and I'll create a ledger Arihan Technologies here under Sundry Data. Alright. So I'll put one amount is two lakh twenty one thousand five hundred on account. I'll debit my uh, SBI current account under bank account group. Here, what I'll do, I'll enable my option set and alter range for checkbooks. And here what I will do, I will put the check range 896110, 1102896111. Alright, so these are the number of checks I am using, two checks I am using. Here I will do is SBI checkbook. Checkbook 1. So here I'll put the instrument number 896110 and specify the bank name that is SBI current account. Alright so this way I have done one entry and in the same voucher I will do another entry with Arihan Technologies. I'm receiving 14,800 on account and view uh, like on SBI current account and here I'll open I'll uh, mention 896110 and specify bank name SBI current account alright so these two entries are done now 
what i will do i'll go to banking feature now and go to deposit slips and now open my sbi current account and you can see these two entries are showing all right so i'll press spacebar on this first entry and i'll press alt plus p enter and i'll go to preview and i'll show you alt plus z the zoom so this is the check deposit slip or pain slip so this is the banker's copy to be kept by the bank uh, with itself and uh, below is the customer copy of check deposit slip which the bank will provide the this customer copy to the customer all right so you can see the check number over here 8961101 on 1st april sbi current account and the amount is 2 like 21500 all right sure next next is arihan technologies is also receiving 14800 so i'll uh, like uh, press space bar over here press alt plus p enter and go to preview and alt plus z and i'll show you check deposit slip of 14800 so you can see that the check numbers for both the receipts are same 896110 so total i have received 236200 so this is the banker's copy and below is the customer copy all right so this way we perform the deposit slips under banking in delhi prime now the next topic is now the next topic is cash deposit slip all right so you should know about the cash deposit slip first before proceeding with the practical so a cash deposit slip is a record of how much money will be and has been deposited into a bank account in simple words a cash deposit slip is a form that is used to itemize the currency and cash is deposited into a bank account any cash received has to be deposited into the bank with the relevant cash deposit slip attached you can generate a cash deposit slip for depositing cash into a bank on a particular day you can also print the cash deposit slip report for all the transactions for the selected period the cash deposit slips provided in delhi prime has all the contents of cash deposit slips like account number account holder name bank name branch name information is fetched automatically from bank ledger company's telephone number information is fetched automatically from company's patient screen and cash denomination details information is fetched automatically from contra voucher so that user will not have to manually enter all the details now i'll show you one entry they have given to me and i'll show you practically how we can generate cash deposit slip so they have given me that on 15th july so let me change the date first 1st july all right so on 15th july So Han Software Private Limited deposited cash of rupees fifteen thousand to SBI current account with the bank reference number two three four five one eight. So first of all, I'll open my contra voucher here. So here, what I'll do? I'll uh, I'm depositing cash, so I'll uh, credit my cash account with fifteen thousand. and first of all i need to alter my cash ledger over here i'll put 40000 in opening balance and debit my sbi current account and for before that i need to added my sbi current account i need to enable the check range 2345182234519 sbi check book 2 all right so this way uh, now 
this is the cash denomination screen so i'll show you like if i if i am depositing 15000 rupees in uh, sbi current account so i need to show the cash denomination over here so i'll i can show that i have 1000 rupees of 1000 uh, uh, like rupees notes uh, like i have 15 notes of 1000 rupees all right i'll specify the bank name sbi current account all right so this way i've done the question now i'll go back to banking i'll go back to deposit slip and now open my sbi current account now here what i will do i'll now what i'll do i'll press f5 and my entry will display on the screen i'll press spacebar over the uh, like entry and press alt plus p press enter go to preview and you can see that by pressing alt plus z you will get your cash deposit slip cash deposit slip this is the banker's copy of 15000 rupees and the below is the customer copy which is to be provided to the customer all right so usually when we visited the bank for the very first time and when we fill the pain slip so usually uh, we get this type of cash denominations uh, like slip uh, to us and the remaining slip is to be kept by the bank by, for itself all right so thank you so much i hope you understood each and every topic from this practical video so i'll get back to you with uh, some other topics in next video thank you so much.